some quadratic equations can be made easy using some smart tricks. Just like the equation 16x square plus 46x minus 35 equal to 0. You can see the coefficients are very very big here and splitting the middle term can be really difficult. So how do you split the middle term easily? So we all know that we need two numbers whose sum that means two numbers a and b which add up to 46 and the product of those two numbers a and b should be the product of this number 16 and this number negative 35. Now what are you going to do? Are you going to multiply these two numbers? Not at all. If you multiply them, it will be a big mistake. Rather than multiplying these two numbers, just split it into its factors. Why am I doing so? Because 35 and 16, no way will give me 46 on addition. So 16 can be written as 2 times 8 and 35 can be written as 5 times 7. But now in place of two numbers, I have four numbers. So I have to regroup them like 2 and 5, they make a 10 and 8 and 7, they make a 56. Can you get a 46 by adding or subtracting 56 and 10? Obviously, yes. And there you have the middle term split factors. You just need to decide on the sign. Here you have plus 46. So the larger one will be positive and the smaller one will be negative. How do you solve this equation now? The two factors which you found out just now, just change the sign. So minus 10 becomes plus 10 and plus 56 becomes minus 56. And what you do next is will be your final step. The coefficient of x square here is 16. So just divide both of them by 16 and reduce them to the lowest form. Here you can see the common factor is 2. So this gives you 5 upon 8 as one of the roots of this equation. And I think here you can have 8 as a common factor. So negative 8 7s are 56, 8 2s are 16. And there we go. The roots of the quadratic equation are obtained.